Hello viewers, welcome back to Mules of Tech Zone. This is the third part of ACB series and in the previous uh, two videos we have seen like how to create a basic API spec using ACB's uh, code builder like any point code builder in the cloud version as well as the desktop version. So here after I'll be using the desktop version and if at all uh, if your uh, laptops are not compatible with uh, when you're downloading microsoft visual studio and all right you can always go with the cloud version all right so now uh, we have seen like how to create a api spec so you can see here like i have a spec api spec already uh, designed the next step is to publish to exchange that is our next step our normal procedure in the design center is once you uh, once you design api spec then you click on like um, you know publish to exchange right so way to find that option in acb right again this tool is based on visual St visual studio right so all the options will be in this terminal so we, let's call this part as terminal okay here whatever you see here right this is terminal and you won't be able to find publish to exchange option anywhere here only way you have to go is like click on this and you should click on show and run commands for sure because then only it will try to show your mule commands so if you type mule you can see all kind of commands that are associated with this uh, acb like for example publish api to api spec to exchange this is what we are going to you know uh, use it but if it is a fragment you will click on like add fragment dependency from exchange api console if you want to delete anything if you want to design all these commands will be present under show and run commands but if i type for example now i am the root level right i am on the root level if i type mule you won't be able to see anything no matching results it will say because you're not inside the show and run commands stuff okay now now i am ready to you know basically deploy this uh, i have already deployed this api spec into exchange but i can uh, you know always deploy the latest version so i'll go here click on show and run commands it is already showing for me on the top because I have recently used it. So if you are not able to view it, just search for MuleSoft or you can also like type exchange. If, if, you, if you're typing exchange, it will not show you that command. But you can always like, oh, again, I have to go to show and run command exchange. Here it is showing like different options for uh, exchange. So I'm going to use publish API expect to exchange next thing is here it is asking again sometimes it will not uh, you might be not able to see these things but be you, you have to concentrate on this command line okay so it is asking to select a business group automatically it will show you the list of business groups that are present that are associated with your anypoint platform account because you have already try to link your anypoint platform account here so whenever if, if you are not able to see it, see it make sure that you have logged in and connected your uh, acb with your anypoint platform account now choose your business group next time uh, it is asking like set a project name i would like to go with like same project name so i will click on you can either press press on enter you have to press enter there is no other option to click it so i am just clicking enter next option is like uh, to define your artifact id i'll go with the same name next it is asking to set your asset version just uh, just like how you see in your design center right only difference is in design center you will see all these options in one screen but here you are going like step by step so i have already deployed two versions 1.0.0 and 1.0.1 my next version would be like 1.0.2 and this is your api version which is similar to what you do in design center and just click enter that's it you can see here it is saying like publishing api spec to exchange in case if there is any error okay if there is any error you can always go to this tab here and you have to go to output and you have to go to mule dx servers okay so mule dx server will show you the actual logs while publishing it to exchange okay it says like api specification successfully published to exchange now if i refresh it you can see my 1.0.2 version is published to exchange now one more interesting thing is it visible in my design center is this like whatever uh, you know whatever acb to and 
here when you publish it is asking like would you like to implement acb demo which is our next step so you can always click no if you don't want to start implementing immediately but if you want to start implementing your raml like you know importing it to in, just like importing it to endpoint studio you can always click s yes. okay and it is asking for a project name so you can use the pro same project name like acb hyphen demo this is your project name which is similar to what you do in any point studio click on enter and it is asking to select a target folder where you want to save it i am saving it it's saying like something failed but that part we can always check probably i'm using the same name here so that we can see in our next video but um, in this video it is just like till publishing to exchange so the thing what i was trying to show you is like acb demo you cannot see my acp demo api spec in the design center reason is because you have uh, coded that in your microsoft visual studio because eventually we will will be moving out to ms visual studio like acb so it won't be visible in your design center however if you still want to view your code in your any point platform when you click on view code it will take you to the design center however it is always in a read only mode you won't be able to edit this in line here but you can always view your code whatever you have you know coded in your uh, visual studio right uh, you can view that here but you cannot edit you can just download the project if you want and you can upload it into the design center but this is how it looks so this is how you basically publish to exchange again if you have any errors or issues please try to go to the output so click on this tab here go to output and choose there are multiple options here right so choose the mule dx server and see if there is any error it will try to show you like what went wrong okay so yep that's all for this session i hope you like this session if you haven't subscribed to my channel please do subscribe uh, for you for my latest videos see you until the next session bye